Hello there and welcome again to another video tutorial on H5P. In this video, you and I are going to talk about on how you can create dialogue cards. Let's go! When you are already in the course, you are going to insert the dialogue cards. First, you're going to have to, of course, turn editing on. After that, proceed to the section where you are going to input H5P activity dialogue cards. Then add an activity or resource, go to activities, then choose H5P. And then fill out all the necessary details. And then other options. Let's go back up and go to the H5P editor by clicking opens a new window in the package file section. When you click on that, you will be automatically directed to the content bank. When you click on add, you will see all the different contents you can use in your course. And since you are here because of the dialogue cards, that's what we are going to choose. Click on that. And here is the editor. Mm, dialogue cards about mm, food. This is all about healthy food. Task description. Hmm. What I want the students to do is to try to guess that the Galog counterpart of each word. Oh. So, hint. Hmm, I think it would be best to insert the image first. Okay, let's choose that one. The instruction says, guess that the Gallup counterpart, right? So the answer should be sagging. And then let's try to add a, hmm, oh, not an audio file. Let's try another one. Let's locate an image. Healthy food. Oh, here. The answer is, of course, it log. Then we also have, okay, let's try another one. Mm -hmm -hmm. Mm. 
Hmm. Let's try. Oh, I can't find any. Oh, this is healthy. This is canine. All right. So once everything is finished, let's see the behavioral settings. Nope. Randomized cards. Yep. Save. Okay, let's see that. Guess the Tagalog counterpart of each word. It is packed with energy inducing molecules. Definitely. This is Kanin. <laughs> A champion of potassium. This is Sagging. And then. A rich source of protein. Of course, this is Itlog. Alright. Let's close that one out. And let's try to put that in our course. Click on the box, go to content bank, and look for, hmm, okay, it's identify the healthy food. Click on that, select this file, and save and display. Okay, click on the box, choose Content Bank, and Choose the one that we have created. Select this file and then save and display. There you go. All right. And so that's how dialogue cards look like. I hope you'll find this useful in your courses. That's it for this video tutorial. Thank you for watching. My name is Titan. Cheers!